Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Ashi Goyal and in this video we are going to solve 4 power x plus 16 power x is equals to 64 power x and we have to find the value of x. So 4 we can write it as 2 square whole power x plus 16 we can write it as 8 times 2 whole power x is equals to 64 as 8 square whole power x. Now according to exponent rule a power n power m we can write it as a power m power n. So similarly 2 power x power 2 plus according to exponent rule x times y whole power m we can write it as x power m times y power m. So 8 power x times 2 power x is equals to 8 power x whole square. Now I'm going to divide with 2 power x whole square throughout the equation. So we can cancel out this. So here we can write this one in form of 2 power x whole square as 2 power x times 2 power x. So when we cancel out this, so what is left? 1 plus 8 power x by 2 power x is equals to 8 power x whole square by 2 power x whole square. Now according to exponent rule x power m by y power m we can write it as x by y whole power m. So 1 plus 8 by 2 whole power x is equals to 8 by 2 whole power 2x. So we can write this as 1 plus 4 power x is equals to 4 power 2x. So let make a substitution 4 power x as s. So 1 plus s is equals to s square or we can write this as s square minus s minus 1 is equals to 0. Now it's look like a quadratic equation so we are going to use a quadratic formula that is s is equals to minus b plus minus under root minus b square minus 4ac by 2a. So here a is coefficient of s square, b is coefficient of s and c is the constant. So let's put the value minus minus 1 plus minus under root minus 1 square minus 4 times 1 times negative 1 by 2 times 1. So s is equals to 1 plus minus under root 1 plus 4 by 2. So s is equals to 1 plus under root 4, 5 by 2. So we have two values of s. So s is equals to 1 plus root 5 by 2 or 1 minus root 5 by 2. So this gives us negative answer. So we are going to reject this case and adopt s is equals to 1 plus root 5 by 2. So we know that we make a substitution s with 4 power x. So we are going to replace it. So 4 power x is equals to 1 plus root 5 by 2. Now I'm taking log both sides. So log 4 power x is equals to log 1 plus root 5 by 2. So x log 4 is equals to log 1 plus square root of 5 by 2. So I'm going to divide with log 4 both sides. You can cancel out. So x is equals to log 1 plus square root of 5 by 2 by log 4. So x is equals to log 1 plus square root of 5 by 2 with base 4. So this is the value of x. 
I hope it's clear. And if I need useful, so please give a thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel. Stay tuned.